Sue Surf, easy to block, Captain. You guys have both been exposed for being doofy. Let's talk about it. Battle Booth is half, half a gang on the low. He half a gang on the low. I'm and I'm I'm Battle Booth gang, so y'all know what it is. Y'all know what it is. The Battle Booth. If you look him up, y'all go subscribe to his channel. already know what it is it's your boy drill coming at you live and direct from the battle beer if you're not subscribed make sure you subscribe you heard hey hey i am not reggie jackson bro i am not reggie jackson i'm not that dude who geechee got exposed on facebook groups because a dude was hitting him up at all hours of the night you know what i'm saying because this is favorite battle rapper I am not that dude, bro. I don't care about any of this, which is why I will sit there and call out a Sue Surf on his BS, bro, on his nonsense, bro, because I don't care for Sue Surf to to like me or to rep. That's why I will sit there and I'll call out Easy to Block Captain on that nonsense that he pulled off on Black Compromised Media. You know what I'm saying? Last week, just spending a whole grip of time just defaming and discrediting a man's name and ish like that, bro. I personally, I don't care, bro. I'm not that guy, and that's why I'm uncompromised, bro. Because I don't care, bro. I don't care if a battle rapper doesn't like me anymore, right? Because I was honest about something that happened. I don't care about that type of thing, bro. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I find it amusing when I make a blog, right? And the people or the person that I was talking about I can find on Twitter responding to me and the blog that I uploaded. I find that very amusing. You know what I'm saying? And then the same person will sit there and tell me that nobody cares. <laughs> Easy to block, Captain. That nobody cares. But you care, sir. You're sitting here responding, going back and forth with me on Twitter. So you care about the blog that I put up having to do with you talking about A Ward, bruh. You care, bruh. I don't care about whether or not you guys like or appreciate what I do. I don't do what I do for to ride a battle rapper's jock, bro. I don't do this to kiss a battle rapper's ass, bro. I do this because I feel like there's things that people need to there's things that need to be brought to the to the to the forefront, you know what I'm saying? There's things that people need to be made aware of, right? There's situations that happen that need to be pointed out. Those are the reasons that I blog, right? I don't blog to appease you, easy to block, Captain. I don't blog to appease you, Sue Surf. I don't blog to appease any of you guys. You know what I'm saying? But that's why I am who I am, and that's why, you know what I'm saying? Like, this is the battle booth, bro. Like, that's, that's just, it is what it is, bro. I'm saying this to say this because, bro, it's funny when... Somebody like Sue Surf, right? Somebody, you know, like Sue Surf comes out of nowhere, right? When I'm having a conversation with somebody online, right? And then Sue Surf comes out of nowhere and says, I would be pissed if I was a blogger and 98 people followed me and nobody listened to my opinion that I think is valid. That's Sue Surf's response to me. Okay, so... I put up a post, right? Because somebody that was, somebody was talking about just whatever. I'll, I'll show you guys a post right here. I put Sue Surf discredits people all the time. Does it only matter when it's being done to Surf and not when Surf is the one doing it? Because somebody was having a conversation about, you know, Surf being criticized or whatever the case was. And I guess him having been accused of having a ghostwriter, I guess, was what the conversation was about. You know what I'm saying? Which is criticism. You know what I'm saying? That's 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 criticizing somebody. If you think somebody has a ghostwriter, that's criticism. So basically, I was making a point that, bro, Sue Surf is a type to literally criticize everybody in the world. Like everybody. Sue Surf will literally dog you. Like he will do y'all remember Cortez? Should I bring in like multiple situations where, where Sue Surf literally kind of like buries somebody, bro, because he talks so much crap about him and discredits them? 
So my point, I'm coming from the perspective of, bro, Sue Surf does it all the time. Like, he discredits people all the time. If people are going to try and, d d like, criticize or discredit him, oh, well, all's fair in love and war, right? You want to play that game? People going to play that game with you. Everything is fair. But when it comes to the surfettes, when it comes to surf cheerleaders, right, when it comes to fanatics of any battle rapper, not just one, they can do no wrong. A battle rapper can do no wrong, bro. None. So in the eyes of surfettes, Surf has never done anything wrong ever. He's a fuck. He's an angel. You know what I'm saying? Which is already kind of, uh, eh, no. Like, this, this, is a, this is a thing, bro. This is why it's the difference between just being a, just a fan and being a a, 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 a cheerleader, bro. This is, there's a difference, but we got to start to be honest with ourselves. So anyways, while we having this conversation, Surf comes out of nowhere, right, and addresses me, all right? Because, I mean, I only have 98... According to you, Sue Surf, I only have 98 people following me on Twitter. So why am I important enough to even respond to if that's the case, bro? Aren't you like battle rap's biggest thing? Like if I'm nobody and I'm somebody with 98 people following me, why even respond to or acknowledge me? I don't understand that. But but he goes on and says, I would be pissed if I was a blogger and 98 people followed me and nobody listened to my opinion that I think is valid. That's funny. And then I go on to let him know that... Uh, <clears throat> They hate when you speak the truth and love when you ride their jocks. And it's the truth. They they hate when you speak the truth, right? And you have your own opinion and you have an honest opinion about something. But they love when you ride their jocks, right? When you're compromised media, right? And, and your job and what you do is to basically kiss their ass all the time, right? And make them look good. They love that, but they hate being called out on the BS, bro. Um, then I said, first of all, I started a Twitter this year. So... He's talking about my Twitter, bro. My Twitter, I started this year because I was actually told to start my Twitter by somebody. I wasn't, I didn't even know what Twitter was. Like, I thought it was Twitter. Like, when, like at first, initially, I was like, this is Twitter. And then somebody put me on to Twitter, said I should start one so I could share my videos more and I can connect more with people in battle rap. So I was like, all right, cool. That was this year. So, bro, I don't even understand what point you're trying to make. Like, with that. like Surf, what are you even talking about, bro? And then I go on to tell Surf, bro, let's not even, let's not even talk about numbers and stats on like YouTube or something, bro. Because Surf hasn't had a YouTube drop in a while. And Surf doesn't upload content to YouTube himself. So I literally have more views on YouTube than Sue Surf does all of 2021. I'm not even, I'm not exaggerating. I'm just being, I'm just being dead ass. Surf, I have more views on YouTube 2021 than you do. Because you don't have any battle drops on YouTube. You don't upload content to YouTube. So it's like, I'm confused. I'm like, bro, you're talking about stats and numbers, but you are trapped in caffeine. You don't have access to your views, your numbers. You don't have access to these things. So you're in no place to tell somebody who, or who has their own thing going on, like anything about their numbers or stats, bro. You don't even know how many views your last battle got. But that's the thing, bro. Like, you can't, you can't be, like, like, and that's with any battle rapper, bro. Like, I swear, bro, you can't be honest because then you're going to be disliked. And that's why I understand why there's so much compromised media because it is a rough community. It is kind of rough where it's like, bro, if, like, if something that you do is not liked, you're going to know. Like, you're going to know that battle rappers, cheerleaders are going to let you know, like, People are not going to hold back their tongue and let you know what it is. So that's I could see why people are afraid to be uncompromised, bro, because people can't handle like the backlash. People can't handle honesty. People can't handle genuity, bro. Like people can't handle authenticity, bro. You can't handle the truth, bro. Like easy to block, Captain. You can't handle the truth, bro. You were called out. I called you out for that BS that you did on Black Compress compromised media bro anybody that watches that interview is gonna see exactly what it is that i was talking about bro i, I even know that easy himself probably watched that back like damn i was kind of going a little bit crazy because that was nuts bro that was wild and then you expect to not be called out on some bs like that is that what we expect you expect to be able to just run amok and just do all this ridiculous stuff and say all these ridiculous things and you're just not going to be called. Nobody's going to say anything about it. Nah, bruh. Nah, bruh. Nah. And Sue Surf, another one, bro. Sue Surf, another one. I get it. 
Sue Surf is on the run right now and blase blah, but let's not forget all the garbage stuff that Sue Surf has done, bro. Like, let's not forget all the trash that he's talked to these to, to, to a lot of these guys, bro. Let's not forget all these things, bro. Like him telling us that he doesn't even care enough about battle rap to bring three rounds and this, that, and the fifth, bro. Like people just seem to forget about all these things, bro. Nah, not me, bro. Not me, man. Surf, easy. I don't care, bro. I'm gonna be extremely critical of you guys now. I'm gonna be extremely critical of you guys now, bro. Just because I know and I see that you guys are paying attention and you guys don't like being called out. So I'm paying even more attention to you guys now, bro. You already know what it is, man. It's your boy Joe coming at you live and direct from the battle.